aspirants who are preparing to crack the admission for various private unaided colleges in Karnataka have to make sure that you are passing COMEDK UGET examination. This entrance examination would give you the access into various other engineering and medical colleges in the state of Karnataka. So if you want to enhance your preparation, you have to be aligned with the examination pattern, the marking scheme, as well as the syllabus. So this will help you to give an insight as to how you are progressing with the entrance examination and having a productive preparation at one go. If you want to take all of this information from one space, all you have to do is head over to exams.freshesnow.com. How can you do that? I'd be showing you further. Before that, I would welcome you all to Precious Now channel where we provide informative videos regarding entrance exam. Stay tuned for more videos like this by subscribing to our channel. So first, as we all do every single day, that is we head over to Google for every of our answer. So first we have to head over to Google and search for C-O-M-E-D-K-U-G-E-T syllabus Precious now. So as you search, you can see the first link itself is from exams.precious now. Our website, just give a click on this, will take you to this particular page. And in this particular page, you will be starting off with a basic entry of the examination or the basic details of what the examination is about. Next off, you are going to get an understanding as to how the examination is marked. So as you can see, the examination is conducted for 3 hours for 180 marks, which means there are 180 questions which would be asked from subjects like physics, chemistry and mathematics. And in these questions, the type or the mode of questioning is going to be under multiple choice questions and it will be only in English language. This examination is not bilingual and each correct answer would be awarded one mark and to top off there is no negative marking in this particular entrance examination. So before we head forward to the main details I would like to request you all to join our telegram as well because in our telegram channel you are going to get all of the updates regarding the entrance exam very instantly. So let us look into the overview. The examination conducting board is from Karnataka Consortium of Medical Engineering and Dental Colleges and this is an undergraduate entrance test. Here you have the official website. You can always cross check or you can always refer to the official website in case if you want any of the latest or the updated information or news regarding this entrance exam. So heading over to the marking scheme each section or each subject you will have 60 questions so as you can see physics chemistry and mathematics have 60 questions in each carrying 160 questions for 160 marks no negative marking one mark for every correct answer there would be three hours time for this examination and everything is multiple choice based further as we look ahead we would be looking into the syllabus which covers class 11 and class 12 covering your fundamentals as well as the basic concepts and giving you an insight about what are the topics that you have to cover for preparation so this will make your preparation much easy and convenient so let us go through it one by one starting with our subject physics for class 11 you have physical world and measurement, kinematics, loss of motion, work, energy and power, motion of system and particles, gravitation, properties of bulk matter, thermodynamics, behavior of perfect gases, oscillation and waves. Next we have physics for class 12. So for class 12, the topics will be further enhanced, electrostatics, current electricity, magnetic effects of current and magnetism, electromagnetic induction and altering current, electromagnetic waves, optics, dual nature of matter and radiation, atoms and nuclei, communication systems and electronic devices. Heading over to chemistry for class 11 and combining class 11 and class 12. You have atomic structure, chemical bonding, states of matter, solid state and then chemical equilibrium, thermodynamics, redox reaction, all the block elements, their families and groups which are clubbed together, chemical kinematics, hydrocarbons, oxygen containing organic compounds, nitrogens, 
then biomolecules, chemistry in everyday life and environmental chemistry. For mathematics, for class 11 covering out the fundamentals or the basics, we have sets and their representation, relations and functions, trigonometric functions, principles of mathematical induction, algebra, complex numbers and quadratic equations, linear quadratic inequalities, fundamental principles of counting, binomial theorem, then you have sequences and series, coordinate geometry, straight lines, conic section, introduction to three dimension geometry, calicus, limits and continuity and probability. For class 12, you would be leveling up a little bit, which covers another topics also along with your basics, which are relations and functions, uh, determinants, matrices, inverse trigonometric functions, adjoint and inverse of a matrix, differentiability, indefinite integers, applications of derivatives, then you have applications of integers, differentiation equations, vectors, three-dimensional geometry and probability. Probability and geometry related all of the topics you are also be covering in class 11. The same with an enhanced point of view you would be covering in class 12 as well. So that is why you have to cover your basics as well as the major concerns of the topics in class 12. So this would be having a core basic foundation for cracking this entrance examination for UG. Well, I hope you have taken down notes. If you have any other questions regarding this, don't forget to place them in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned by subscribing to our channel.